Jonathan, a really proud moment for the organisation. We've been awarded with the Premier League Equality Standard Intermediate level just recently, the first club outside of the Premier League to get that award. It's a real mark of the progress the club has made. Yeah, we're delighted. It's a really proud moment for the football club um, to be awarded the Equality Standard, uh, something that no other football league club has done and we're delighted to, to be awarded that honour. Mm -hmm. And what does it mean generally? It's not something perhaps people are that aware of, but something we obviously want to promote. What does it mean for us as a club and, and generally? It's about uh, promoting uh, inclusion. It's about uh, three strands of the organisation, equality, diversity and respect. And it's something that we've, we've been working towards for the past three or four years. Uh, it's something that I'm very passionate about and, and everyone at the football club is very passionate about. Um, we looked to, to uh, raise awareness of these issues, uh, firstly amongst our staff, uh, our supporters, our customers on non-match days, uh, and then looked at the general population as a whole in Wigan uh, and how, how we represented that community uh, and making sure that everything that we do as a business uh, is positive in that regard uh, and that we, we avoid discrimination whenever we can. Uh, it's about doing, doing things properly and, and, and running the business, the organisation, the football club, the stadium and the community trust uh, in a way that the, the people of Wigan will be proud of. Mm -hmm. And obviously something fans will be aware of is the Together initiative. There's been a lot of work going on around that, as you mentioned, over the last few years. That's been nominated for the North West Football Awards, Kick It Out, Promoting Inclusion Award, really, again, more recognition, which it can only be a good thing. Yeah, a lot of staff have worked really hard uh, to, to achieve this recognition. And this is only, uh, it is positive recognition, but this is only the start of the process for Wigan Athletic. We'll continue to embed uh, equality and diversity into everything that we do uh, and we'll continue to do that uh, but certainly the likes of Tom Flower who's our head of community and Louise Kerrigan who's our head of uh, HR and Safeguard who worked really hard to, to get us to this point. Um, together is, is uh, about bringing together the community trust, the football club and the stadium working together but also making sure that as I say that we promote inclusion uh, and, and it's, it's led to lots of things like supporting uh, Wigan Pride. Uh, we do things like blind shortlisting of, of applications for, for people that want to work for the organisation. Um, we've improved and, and uh, enlarged our disability programme in terms of uh, football and sport. Um, we've looked at uh, creating uh, better communication with our, uh, our female fans, with a, a female fans focus group. There's lots of examples where we we're, we're looking to improve the organisation but at the same time promote equality and diversity. Kick It Out have branded us as a leading light for the way we promote equality and diversity within our organisation as the club's chief executive. That must make you very proud. It does make me very proud uh, and everyone at the football club uh, should be very proud of their achievements in, in achieving this recognition. Uh, and for somebody like Kick It Out to say those things it, it's great to hear uh, but this is just the start of, of the work that we're doing around equality and diversity. As I say, it's great to get the recognition and, and achieve this standard, but it's something that we'll continue to do. It's something that we will endeavour to be, be part of the organisation going forward. Um, equality, diversity, promoting inclusion will be, will be uh, something that the football club and the stadium and the community trust will continue to, to uh, promote uh, and, and the football club will, will work um, in these areas as hard as it has done over the last couple of years going forward.